I wanted to come out and do a cooking class. We always do one cooking class for free every month in the community, sometimes kids, sometimes elderly, sometimes it's something like the Fortune Society. I think it's really important when work in Harlem to be part of the community to give. And coming here and learning about these uh, wonderful people's journey, how they have gone through the ups and downs, and now on the positive side of that, I just think it's fantastic. It's something we can all learn from. When you're eating this, you're tasting all these flavors and you, the crunch because you know you're not watering down your salad by adding too much dressing and stuff like that. And like I said, the the sweetness of the grapefruit, it was good. I am a former uh, incarcerated person. I've lived at the academy and now I work for the Fortune Society. And when I heard Marcus Samuelson was coming, I wanted to come and see what he bought because it's, it's an honor and it's a very, it's a treat for us. We hosted Marcus Samuelson from Red Rooster who talked about how easy it is to get a soda in this community and how hard it is to find an apple. What we've been trying to do at the Fortune Society is to build a healthy community, a community that helps people come from being institutionalized into being people who matter in the community. And health also means food. And we're teaching people how to change their cooking and eating habits. Marcus Samuelson, as a guest, is wonderful. He's teaching a lesson to people who've never learned how to cook well or who've grown up eating institutional food. So this felt like a marriage made in heaven. We stalked him. We went looking for him. We invited him to come. We hope that this is not a one-night stand because we want an ongoing relationship with him.